Catalyzing Change was a series of books challenging stakeholders in mathematics and mathematics education to think differently about some of the challenges and successes we have in the classroom and in our schools and our districts and in the country and proposing initial conversations to start thinking about where we are going as a field. It's really transforming how we are breaking down those systemic barriers and providing those equitable practices and really broadening the participation and what it means to do mathematics. The Catalyzing Change series, from my perspective, isn't recommendations like a set of standards. They were really meant to catalyze conversation. One of the things, though, is people want to know what did this look like in action? What happens when you do this? What are the challenges? What are the barriers? What are the successes? What are the things you need to remember? And so thus, we started trying to find places that were enacting some of these recommendations and what they were facing. And that was when we published the success stories because it actually shows illustrations of real people doing this in action in their districts, in their classrooms, and across states. We put out a call for proposals for schools, districts, states that were we're implementing some of the recommendations relative to catalyzing change. So we had some teacher stories, we had some district stories, we had some state level stories because we thought that would be most helpful to the field, they could see themselves in one of those aspects. Some of the stories were pretty exciting about what the teachers are doing relative to getting students more active in their learning. How the teachers are engaging with the material and really trying to think about the recommendations from the Catalyzing Change series, what that would mean for equity and inclusion, and how they can put that into practice in their own classrooms.